A spring morning, the date, May the 9th, 1967. The place, Schiphol, Holland. The time, 5.19 a.m. A spring morning, just like any other, except for one thing, a sleek green and white jet taxiing for takeoff, its first. Latest in a long line to bear one of the most famous names in aviation, the Fokker F-28 Fellowship. ground control, tension begins to relax on the faces of the men who've lived and breathed the F-28 for five long years. Men who've given it such advanced design features as unique tail-mounted speed brakes.
an effortless landing. The first flight is over. The F-28 has behaved perfectly. Now Captain Moll, Fokker's chief test pilot, brings her gently back. A happy man, for this is the never-to-be-forgotten moment when a dream has become reality. In the comments of Captain Moll, this is a real pilot's aircraft. Control response and feel are most pleasant, and the excellent view, cockpit layout, and low noise level would make anybody confident right from the start. A memorable occasion is over. Now the F-28 rests, her first big test successfully completed. But there will be many others. Elegant, seating 55 to 65 passengers, powered by two Rolls-Royce Spey Junior turbofans, with speed brakes, low pressure tires, and complete self-support capabilities. F-28 Fellowship is the perfect answer to fast expanding traffic on the short haul routes of the 60s and 70s.